So, you've probably heard that we live in the information age. Information and its various stages of development are all around us. And right now, we're going to learn how data grows up into information all the way through full-grown knowledge. At the very beginning, we have data. Data are raw facts that describe the characteristics of an event or object. Beginning particularly in the 80s and 90s, everybody was collecting all sorts of data. But let's take a look at an example. If you look at figure 1.1, we have the example of Tony's Stack Company. It's really hard to find anything in this that can really help us with the business. That's because raw data has no context. It's just a recording of transactions, a recording of the facts. What happens with just a little meaningful and useful context? We get information, and having the right information at the right time can be worth a fortune. If we look at figure 1.2 and 1.3, we start to discover something. We can begin to answer questions like, who was Tony's best customer by sales? And who is his least valuable customer? What is the best and least selling product by sales or maybe by profit? How much in dollars did the best sales rep bring in? So what more could we possibly want? How about information collected from multiple sources, such as suppliers and customers, competitors, partners, and industries, that has been analyzed for patterns and trends to identify relationships for strategic decision making, something we call business intelligence. Business intelligence might combine information from external sources such as the weather to predict max sales. Wow, that's as far as it goes, right? Nope, there's one more step. Knowledge. Knowledge includes the skills, experience, and expertise coupled with information and intelligence that creates a person's intellectual resources. So suppose our friend Tony finds out that his weakest sales over the last period come from a guy named Craig Schultz. So should he fire Craig? Well, Tony has more knowledge than that. He knows that Craig was out on medical leave for several weeks and that in many other periods, Craig was the best salesperson. Data, information, and business intelligence are all great. But without skills, experience, and expertise, an important piece of the puzzle is missing, and bad decisions can be made. Created using Powtoon.